Today I'm going to be cooking a recipe from the website Recipe Tin Eats and it's their epic chunky beef and mushroom pie. Stay tuned and hope you enjoy the video. We're going to use diced chuck steak, sliced bacon, sliced Swiss brown mushrooms, beef stock, finely chopped onions, garlic, and carrots, four bay leaves, a few sprigs of thyme, some finely chopped celery, and some more chopped carrots, porcini mushrooms soaked in hot water, and some flour. Heat up a heavy bottom saucepan, and then to it we add about a tablespoon of oil, and then we brown our beef in batches. So once the beef has been browned, we add onions, the garlic, and the carrots. And we stir fry them until they're all soft and fragrant. Then we add our flour and stir until everything is combined. Next we add our beef stock. Next we add our herbs, our bay leaves and our thyme. Then we add the porcini mushrooms that we soaked in hot water, saving the liquor as it's got the yummy mushroom flavor. We will need that to add to our stew for extra oomph and umami. Then we add the cooked beef back into our stew. I transferred the beef to simmer on another element and in another pan, fry up some bacon and fry the bacon until it's golden brown. We then fry the mushrooms in the bacon fat for about 5 minutes until they're golden brown. We then add the bacon back into the mushrooms. And put it in the stew. Whilst the stew is simmering, you might want to adjust the seasoning with salt and pepper according to your taste. I'm using store-bought puff pastry. I'm going to need one and a bit sheets of the pastry to cover my pie.
cover the pie dish with a puff pastry, folding the ends into the stew. Make slits into the pastry. And brush the top with egg yolk. Place the pie into the oven and bake for 30 minutes at 200 degrees Celsius. After 30 minutes, the pie is ready. See the steam? Today I cooked the epic chunky beef and mushroom pie by Recipe Team Eats. The recipe serves six, so I doubled it and it very generously served 10 people. Um, it took about three hours to make and about 20 minutes to eat. So it was very, very yummy, full of flavor. Uh, it was beefy, the mushrooms are great. Um, I would have liked to have used more puff pastry, so maybe next time I will use puff pastry underneath as well, so it eats like a proper pie, rather than just pastry on top. And the recipe also called for uh, dark ale to be used, to be added to the filling, but I didn't have it, so I just used beef stock. But nevertheless, it still was very, very good. Will I make it again? Yes. And so, hope you enjoyed the video. Until next time, I'll see you soon. Bye.